for this camp right now. We ready, man. Stay tuned. Mm, let's get ready to rumble! All right, you fight fan fanatics out there. This is Bobby D coming to you with a full press conference for the Manny, the Senator Pacquiao versus Keith Wontime Thurman, WBA World Wonderwood title, MGM Grand Las Vegas, Nevada, July 20th, scheduled for 12 rounds. For Pacquiao, you know what I'm saying? That's my that's my hype song for this camp right now. We ready, man. What's up, New York? What's up, everybody, man? Um, it's a blessing to be here. I want to thank God first and foremost. Um, this is just a dream come true, guys. I um, started boxing at the age of seven. I put blood, sweat, and tears in this sport. I worked hard to be a champion. Uh, I've always wanted to fight some of the greatest names in the sport of boxing. Uh, years ago, you know, I wanted the Floyd Mayweather, I wanted Manny Pacquiao. Floyd's gone, Pacquiao's here, and he wants the challenge. And I'm very grateful, very happy to be sharing the ring with a legend like Manny Pacquiao. But, you know, for those who know boxing and truly understand boxing history, you know, times change. I believe boxing has come to a new era. Floyd is gone, Pacquiao's here. Come July 20th, he will disappear, okay? He will disappear. He announced him as a senator. He belongs as a senator in the Philippines. With all respect, he is a legend. He will always be remembered in the sport. But I'm doing to Manny Pacquiao what he did to Oscar De La Hoya. You can Google it if you want to. Oscar De La Hoya never fought again, all right? Facts. This is a big fight. Bombs are being dropped. I've waited 22 months to get back in the game. People can say what they want about my injuries. I'm a professional athlete. We have our ups and downs. And obviously, your boy Keith One Time Thurman is back on the rise. I'm here. I'm going to make a big statement. You are not going to want to miss this fight, especially because it's about to be this man's last fight. You, you, know, you think I'm playing? This ain't no game, guys. This ain't no game. Hard work and dedication. Last training camp, Jose Cito Lopez. I trained in LA Fitness all by myself, okay? This training camp, I got two personal trainers. It all starts this Saturday. After this press tour, when I get home, it's grind time. It's my time. This your boy, Keith One Time Thurman. Thank you very much, God bless. Thank you, Keith. Certainly no stranger to the microphone or mega events. Keith brings it every single fight and every single press conference. And certainly the same can be said about his opponent. His record, 61 wins, 7 losses, 2 draws, 39 wins coming by way of knockout. A fighting senator from the Sarangandim province in the Philippines. He most recently defeated Adrian Broner in January. Everyone knows he's the three-time fighter of the year, boxing's eight-division world champion, a fighter of the decade, the current regular WBA welterweight champion of the world. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the microphone the legend, the one and only Senator Manny Pac-Man Pacquiao. Thank you. Uh, good afternoon um, to all of us. I would like to thank God for uh, this opportunity. I've been in this um, uh, boxing uh, for uh, two decades, and uh, um, I never uh, scared or intimidated um, with uh, my opponent. And I'm so excited for this, this fight because I'm fighting with uh, undefeated. Uh, Keith Thurman is um, he's, uh, he's kind of fighter that you cannot underestimate. He's, um, he's uh, undefeated, and, and this is, uh, give me more um, encouragement, um, motivation to work hard, uh, like what I did before in my um, uh, previous fights against uh, a big name in boxing. And uh, I, I'm, 
I will not uh, predict this fight, but I will make sure that um, I'm 100% conditioned and ready for the fight. Uh, let's see if um, who's um, who's tougher in, in the ring in, in on uh, July 28. Uh, this is going to be exciting, and, and I like it. I like it that um, the way I, I um, underdog for this fight. Uh, this gives gives me more uh, motivation and um, encouraging to to focus and work hard in training. And this is fun. This is what I want. And sometimes I be became uh, careless and confident because I'm so um, uh, favored in, in, in every fight. But this time around, I, it's different. I'm telling you the truth. So make sure that you tune in. July 20, it's going to be a good fight. A lot of action in the ring. And we know Keith, uh, Keith Orman is um, he's a good fighter also. Uh, we we make sure that the fans will make uh, will be happy on, on July 28th. That's that's that guarantee, and we work hard from now on to uh, July 28th. We work hard our training, focus our training, and um, that's it. And I would like to thank to all the sponsors, especially NGM, um, Al Heyman for uh, giving me this opportunity. Um, even though at 40, 40 years old, but you see the 40 years old on uh, July 20. I'll come. Thank you. God bless. Here's the tale of the tape. First, we have Manny, the senator, Pac-Man Pacquiao, with 61 wins, 7 losses, 39 KOs, 2 draws, 70 total bouts, 56% KO, 5-6 height, 67-inch reach, southpaw, He's Filipino and 40 years old. Here's Keith Thurman, 29 wins, no losses, 22 KOs, no draws, 29 total bouts, 76 percentage KO, 5'9", height, reach, 69, stance, orthodox, nationality, American, age 30. Blackman's won four of his last five fights, the most significant being his win over Lucas Mathisi with a TKO in July of 2018. With that win, he became the WBA regular welterweight champion. Keith One Time Thurman has won five out of his last five fights. His most notable fight was his last fight with Jose with Lopez, and he barely won the fight in January. He was coming off of a long layoff due to injury, and many people say he was suffering from ring rust. He's currently the WBA super welterweight champion. At the age of 40, Manny Pacquiao is still an incredible fighter. He's still beating up top fighters. He's still willing and able to take on top fighters. Manny has no problem pulling the trigger. His in and out game is still there. His ability to pull the trigger and still react is still there. And that's what usually goes first on an older fighter. That makes Manny an incredibly dangerous guy. Now size wise, Manny's a little bit underwhelmed compared to some of the welterweights that are out there. Pacquiao may have lost a step and he slowed down a bit but against Thurman he's got to be a lot faster and more powerful than Thurman. Neither of the fighters faced a common opponent for Pacquiao to win this fight. He's got to pressure Thurman consistently throughout the fight throwing lefts and jabs and right hooks and staying in his face and if he does that early if he tires Thurman out, he may have a chance to win this fight. The senator will have to be in peak condition because Thurman, much like uh, Mayweather, is a runner. If Pacquiao continues to pressure him and stays away from Thurman's jab, Pacquiao, is, this is the key for Pacquiao winning this fight. Now, as far as Keith Thurman, the only thing he has over Pacquiao is youth and height. Pacquiao has more experience over Thurman. For Thurman to win, 
He's got to throw stinging jabs, shorten his punches, and throw a lot of counter punches. Now, if he shortens his punches, he's going to close the distance between him and Pacquiao. And Pacquiao has short punches, and it's still lethal. Throwing counter punches means engaging Pacquiao in a slugfest. And I don't think that's something that Thurman wants to do. Because Pacquiao is one of the best toe-to-toe -to -toe brawlers in the business. So for Thurman to win this fight, he's got to throw a lot of jabs, stinging jabs, and then short his punches. And run, Thurman, run, if Manny gets inside. That's what he does. Thurman's a runner. The latest figures I show Pacquiao is an underdog and Thurman has a favorite to win. Here's my pick. Pacquiao wins this fight with a split decision. I'm betting on the Senator to penetrate and bridge the gap at all one time Thurman for at least seven of the 12 rounds. Let's go, Let's go Senator, Senator Manny. 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 for me in the comment section of this video and as always remember to like share and subscribe this is Bobby D saying take care God bless and peace a towering presence run like the wind be a king or queen. Life in the Philippines.